physically you know, do all this stuff. And, um, so I've always trained really hard, you know, and so in terms of uh, those details of the workouts, you know, lots of squats, lots of single leg stuff, a lot of, you know, you know, jumping and moving around, keeping the heart rate up, just, you know, but, uh, but yeah, it's, um, it's been a really good off season for me. You know, unfortunately I didn't get to go out here the first day, which is, which stinks. But, and Landon uh, Roberts just said he, you're like a sponge, you're, he wants a sponge off you. He wants your longevity and success yeah. off at your age, at your tenure in the NFL. How do you kind of pick up things off the younger guys and help yourself? Well, I think, you know, first of all, you, Rob and I, you know, we've been able to play against each other. We've been, you know, a lot of these guys I've played against over the years, Cam, TJ, um, a lot of the guys, Minka. Um, so the thing is, is that, you know, we were, E-Rob and I were talking the other day while we, were get, while we were getting ready for the day early in the morning and just talking, he was asking questions about, hey, how do you, how do you prepare on a Monday? How do you prepare on a Tuesday? All these details. And, and uh, Minka was asking the same thing on the field today, you know, just the thought process and how do you get prepared every day? So to be able to ex explain that knowledge and to be able to go through that and talk about that, you know, and just the details of how do you take care of your body every day throughout it all. Even when you do have dings and injuries, it's physical games, we're working hard and stuff happens. And the reality is, is that, you, you know, the, the big question is how fast can you get back every time, you know, and, and uh, that's always the mentality you have to have. And I've, all, I've always had. And so I think treatment and all that's really important. You know, obviously the weight room is really important. Condition, all that stuff's really, really imperative. And so be able to share that. And so learning from the younger guys, too, it's like, you know, I always ask them, what are you guys doing to stay so young? You know, and so it's always good. Um, and, uh, so there's a lot of questions, you know, always from the younger guys to me in particular, um, you know, to, uh, figure out, Hey, what's your, what's your, what's your, uh, treatment plan every week, every day. Um, and so those are good things and that's a good part of the, part of the leadership and being a vet and everything else. Can you you talk about, can you talk back, about. How fast can you get back? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I, I want to get back today, yesterday, you know, um, but coach, coach and coach is like, ah, listen, we got. At that time, you were still, you know, and I got a lot of reps in, in the offseason, so we're not just trying to rush it. We got, you know, I, I say we got 21 games, 20, 20 to 21 games to play, you know. Um, and somebody said, we got, well, we got to have you for 17. I'm, I'm thinking 21, possibly 20, hopefully, <laughs> first place, you know. But that's just got to be the mentality you have. And so we're just, um, you know, just uh, I'm, I'm excited to get the, get the work every day. The guys are doing a tremendous job of, of learning and, and studying and all the bonding we're doing. We were sitting out on the, on the porch last night, just talking, having fun. Those are the kind of moments that you cherish. And you know, I'll, I'll be back uh, sooner than later. Well, you I talked about Justin facing five? some adversity as well. Justin faced some adversity as well as you yesterday. Getting that text early, 6 a.m. that he was going to be running with the ones. We saw you out there. What was your approach kind of the last two days, having to kind of hang back and be able to maybe help him a little bit through that adversity as well? Yeah, I think communication, I think I think leadership's everything, you know, uh, talking to the guys, uh, not just him, but also the other quarterbacks as well, but then also the receivers, O-line, just keeping the energy high. You know, I'm a, I'm a big believer in high energy, uh, positivity, uh, uplift and communication, um, you know, the extra work afterwards before before as well. Um, finding those moments, those 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 little moments that maybe become a big moment in a big game, and, and uh, those things add up. And so the role doesn't change in terms of leading and, and thinking and processing and uh, processing every play and the protections and all that. All that matters, you know. And and uh, that's that's um, that's the best way to learn sometimes too is is you you do it physically, and then you also when you're not in, whether if I'm you know going or not, it's you you, you take those reps in, and so. And that's even when I'm watching the scout team on defense or offense or whatever it may be. I'm just watching the defense. I'm studying, and uh, that's the that's the that's the fun part about practice is you got two hours of, of learning to do, and uh, then you get to do it in the film room and you keep going the next day. So oh, yeah. how was doing that? Was talking how about Russ, Mike was talking about how he wanted to create some short-term misery for you when he <laughs> said that he was going to hold you out. What was that conversation like? Is it misery for you to not be able out there? To yeah, I, I, I hate not practicing. So, uh, but yeah, he was like, man. You, he was laughing. He's like, I, I enjoy this. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you know, wait a second and, and all that. So it was funny. Um, I think that um, coaches just being, you know, uh, coach and the, and the trainers and all that being just super careful, just so nothing gets worse or nothing happens. You know, that's all. Um, you know, we got we got some good pass rushers on the other end. You know, so just, just make sure this thing's right. You know, but anyways, um, you know, I really enjoy being around Coach Tomlin. His his um, his understanding of, of the game, of people, of relationships. Um, you know, he's honest. He's thought. He's thoughtful. Yeah, uh, not just to me, but to everybody. I'm just. It's. It's really remarkable uh, to to be a part of and to watch and understand. And no wonder why. You know, and it, you know we've won so much here. Uh, you know, there's a lot of great football um, and a great tradition. And, and it really starts with the, the tremendous head coach that they've had over the past. You know, obviously, and uh, there hasn't been many of them. Uh, and there's a reason why. So as you've been taking all those mental reps, how's 
what Justin's been doing? Has he been watching how he's been executing what you've been seeing? Yeah, he's done a good job. You know, he's he, every every play is going against a really good defense. So every day, you know, he, there, there's some really great plays and there's some plays that he responds, you know, back to and this and that. So it's just that's the part of practice, and he's doing a good job. He's he's a, a really good competitor. He's thought, you know, you know, he's, he processes as well. Um, you know, and uh, he's a tremendous young talent for sure. Does the cat feel better today? Yeah, I feel better. I'm getting better every day. Uh, how is you have it, a target for a return? Or uh, I'm just listening to them, what, what they want me to do. I'm, 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 I'm trying to return every day, you know, so, um, but just, you know, just take one day at a time and, uh, you know, and uh, that's that's the process. How about a couple more? Just the, the benefit of that time with, with Arthur to be able to kind of go over things as, as you're watching them happen. Yeah, well, I, you know, I, um, you're always taking things in, you know, the knowledge that you can gain, um, you know, from the meetings and taking that from the meetings to the walkthrough, the walk through the field and then post practice and communication during practice and in between periods is, is critical. It's everything, you know, and you have to be able to do that constantly. And uh, I've always been a big believer of that, you know, um, I've been a big, big believer that um, the little things matter and, and you learn those things, the details. And when you get to teach those details and work with guys and ask them, hey, what do you think on this as, as players too as well and coaches? Uh, there's a lot of information to be to be gained, and uh, we're doing that right now in that process. How is the energy level here compared to where you've been? Oh, there's some, been some great places I've been, but this is really special, uh, obviously. And uh, I'm just grateful to be here, man. It's just uh, see all the black and gold around. Uh, you know, um, it's it's pretty cool. All the kids. My my favorite part of training camp, besides throwing touchdowns and winning and doing all this fun stuff and the competitiveness in the offense and defense, is the kids. Honestly, just to uh, to see the kids out here and just them having fun. Um, them wearing my jersey, TJ Watts jersey, Cam Hayward, whoever's jersey they're wearing or, or whatever black and gold they're wearing. That's the fun part of it. They get to see um, us because we were young kids like this. I remember when I was a young kid just like this, hoping to get out here one day. And uh, it's all possible. Uh, I believe with, with God, with hard work, with just um, with just great sense of uh, urgency as a young young man, young girl, a young woman. It, it's just it, it's possible. And, uh, you know, I remember being behind that, that – that, the FedEx sign over there, um, the Steelers sign behind that one day back in the day, and and now I'm in, in between the white lines. So it's a special thing, and never take it for granted. Thank you guys. Go see. Thank you for checking out this content from Post Gazette Sports. If you watch this video on YouTube, please like the video and subscribe to our channel. For all of the sports coverage the Post Gazette has to offer, visit post-gazette.com.